about three years ago now, coming up on three years, I received an email from Professor Bodhi Rogers. And the email said, we, hey, we got a new 3D printer. So I found a YouTube video of another student working uh, with prosthetic hands. And I just thought it would be a great time to kind of get on board with that. Conventional prosthetics can get very, very expensive. And consider a, a family that would need to get one for a child, but the child would simply outgrow it in a few months. Uh, this model allows us to uh, reprint prosthetics as the child would grow up. I try to use it a lot, uh, just kind of around the apartment and around the lab and whatnot, to really get a sense of what it would be like to, uh, to have to use it for everything. As Ryan started focusing his effort on the hand, that was a neat transition, and now he is the one who runs the laboratory. So we've set it up that he's a, a paid teaching assistant where he works certain hours in the lab, and he meets with pro professors, meets with students to talk about their projects, and then coordinates other students in the lab, other interns, to help get those projects through to completion. I, I like showing people uh, what 3D printing can be used for. I'm working with occupational therapy students on some of their projects, and it, it's cool to be able to share expertise. I certainly plan to continue uh, modifying it and I also plan to get my current modifications uh, up on the internet to keep everything open source and uh, share with the wider Enable community.